this is a story about a family and some friends what were in a valley, but then they found themselves in another land. A land where there is a wit. A wit it looked high up in the mountains. But they had to be very careful not to cross with the wit. A bad thing would happen. These are the stories. It was at night time. It was night time now. They were having a party. They were having a lot of fun at the party. They were having a lot of fun indeed at the party. Tom and Sarah's dad said, we are having a lot of fun at the party, they are. Jeff said, yeah, the party is a lot of fun, isn't it? A lot of fun indeed. It basically came to the point where the party was over. So it was off the bat, so they had to go to bed, and that's what they had to do. When they were trying to get to sleep, they had strange sound from outside. They didn't know what it was, but they said just to know it and try to get to sleep anyway. Hopefully, it'll just go away, and that's what they're hoping. It was the next day, and it was a lovely day. The sun was shining brightly late that day. It was a pretty awesome day. Okay, they went to see W how for breakfast. They had breakfast. Breakfast was quite lovely. Very lovely indeed. After breakfast, they said what to do, and they said it would be awesome idea to go for a walk. And that's what they're going to do. They're going to go for a walk. Basically said, oh, I, I think we should go back now. Gene said, yeah, I, I think we should go back now too. Tom said, what did you think about the noise you heard? Did you hear it last night? Gene said, I heard it, and Holly said, I heard it. Tom said, let's hope that doesn't happen again. So let's go back, and they all go, let's go back then. It was night time. Eddie was asleep, but Tom was awake. He heard noise from outside. He was told this to ignore it, but he could not get to sleep. So he got in his clothes and went outside and heard what the voices were, and that's what he did. Tom basically said, are you the girl it was calling the noise? The girl said, I am. I'm a princess. I'm 
the princess of the moon. Tom said, okay. The girl said, I like you. You wanna go out in the moon with me? Tom said, okay. The girl said, come, let's go out in the moon together. Okay, the moon girl carried Tom out in the sky. They were in front of the moon. The moon girl kicked Tom and made out with him. Tom liked it. He enjoyed it. It was fun. And then suddenly something was going to happen. When Tom woke up, he found himself in his own bed in his own room. He did not know what exactly did happen, but he was glad it was over. Like I said earlier, Tom was in his own room in his own bed. He did not know what the hell did happen, but he was glad it was over. Afterwards, he tried to get to sleep behind but he would not tell a her soul on what exactly happened because he knew they would not believe him. So eventually he got to sleep and he did get to sleep. Okay, it was the next day. It was a lovely day. The sun was shining bright on that day. It was a pretty awesome day. Tom and Sarah's dad said, Come on, guys, let's go to the W house and get breath. And they said, Let's go and get breath. And that's what they did. They got breath. They were basically at W how having breath. Tom don't remember that dream he had last night, but he would not tell anyone about the dream he had because he knew that people would not believe, so he did. So basically they had breath, but he cut the This is basically where this movie ends for now. Thank you for watching and goodbye for now. Goodbye. Thank you.